living with the nature has its uh, own advantage and if you have lived with it for uh, during your childhood in fact it is more advantage and it's a more learning experience so i always keep on wondering that uh, when i used to see the advertisements of united nations for a post of uh, maybe director assistant secretary general under secretary general uh, i always uh, read the qualifications so the typical qualification will run like this english is essential but knowledge about yet another language will be advantageous i also learned that post graduate is must but the having a phd will be the advantage so i i keep on wondering why that advertisement for selection does not include something like this that knowledge about environmental protection and the study and the education in that is essential but the background of living with the nature living with the tribal or those who belong to the tribal areas or those who belong to the tribal families the village families they will be preferred because the mind of those such kind of candidates has already been prepared and probably matured enough to understand the value of the nature the united nation understands the what nature gives us the united nation understands the importance of protecting the nature but i don't think united nations have fully understood or i'm talking about the people working in united nations the value of that natural system and unless you start putting the price to it and unless we put the value tag to it we will never understand what exactly the nature uses for us